Creation of the world Genesis means beginning or origin. The book of Genesis is a collection of stories handed down by word of mouth over many hundreds of years, long before they were put into writing. The book has no named author nor publication date although, some scholars think it may have been written as recently as six years before Jesus was born. The underlying principle of creation is that God is love and He has always existed. Wishing to share His love with others, He created angels. They were not in His image or likeness and sadly, some, filled with their own pride and led by the archangel Lucifer, rebelled. The rebellious angels were cast into hell, a place of eternal damnation and separation from God. Then God created the heavens and the earth, day one, God created light and separated it from darkness. The light He called day and the darkness night. Day two, God separated the water from the sky. Day three, God separated the land from the sea, and He covered the land with plants and trees which produced seeds and fruits. Day four, God made the sun, moon and stars, all shining down on the earth. Day five, God made sea creatures and birds. Day 6, God made land creatures, cattle, creeping things, and wild animals, each according to its kind, and then God said, Let us make humankind in our image, after our likeness, so they may rule over the fish of the sea and the birds of the air, over the cattle, and over all the earth, and over all the creatures that move on the earth. Genesis 1 26 the writer presents God's creation as a seven-day timeline, giving God's work both logic and order. We are not told when God created the world nor the great scientific details involved. Instead, an emphasis is placed on God's almighty power, that everything He created is good and the people He created are in His likeness. Genesis 1 31 On the seventh day, God ceased work and made the day holy. That's a well-tested format for healthy living. Praised be you my Lord with all your creatures, especially Sir Brother Son, who is the day through whom you give us light. And he is beautiful and radiant with great splendor, of you Most High, he bears the likeness. Almighty Father, thank you for the beauty of your creation. Canticle of Creatures, Saint Francis of Assisi, Soul of Christ, Sanctify me Body of Christ, Save me Blood of Christ, Inebriate me Water from the Side of Christ, Wash me passion of Christ, strengthen may you good Jesus, hear me within thy wounds, Lord, hide me suffer me, not to be separated from thee from the malicious enemy defend me in the hour of my death call method I may praise thee with thy saints and angels, forever and ever. Amen. Day 7, God's creation was completed, it was good. He blessed the seventh day and he rested.